Hey everybody, welcome to this session. We are going to talk about how to use plugins with Nagios XI. Well, I guess the real big question is what is a plugin? What does it do? Why do I need it? Why do I want one? A plugin is the answer to this question. Can Nagios monitor this thing? Can Nagios monitor Amazon Web Services? Can Nagios monitor a couch based database? Can Nagios monitor a uninterruptible power supply? The answer to all those is always yes, if there is a plugin. So we're going to take a look at how to find a plugin, how to upload a plugin, how to install it, and how to get it going. All right, so, you know, to me, the most natural question after you find out that Nagios can monitor anything there's a plugin for, well, you want to know, is there actually a plugin for this thing that I want to monitor? Well, some great news on that. For one, Nagios Exchange is a website with more than 4,000 plugins. So there's a really strong chance that what you're looking to monitor, there is a plugin available for you on Nagios Exchange. The good news is Nagios XI also comes with a large number of plugins already on board. Let's take a quick look at those before we head over to the Exchange. Go up to Configure and then hover over that and click on Core Config Manager. And then we're gonna go over here to Monitoring Plugins. So, bada bing, here we are. This is a great screen, very useful. We can upload a plugin. So if we find a plugin on Exchange, we can get it uploaded here. And you can also see all of the plugins that come with XI just out of the box. We've got all of these things that we can do. We got a lot of SNMP. We got check SSH. So there are a lot of plugins already preloaded. One thing that you can check on also, if you look at configuration wizards, configuration wizards are really just a graphical way to get through configuring plugins. So there's a plugin really behind any of these. So this SNMP wizard, if we just put in some data like that just to keep going through, really all it's going to do is help you configure in a very graphical way a plugin. So let's take a quick look at Exchange. Okay, so here we are at Nagios Exchange. You can find it on the web at exchange.nagios.org. There's a number of things going on with the Exchange website. We're gonna focus on the plugins. We could click here, but I'll tell you what, if we go up here and put our search terms in like monitor Java and search away, that will bring us to a bunch of results with a number of plugins that you can use. We're going to take the first result. We're going to click through to the page of that. Here's the download URL. I'm going to click that and here we go. I'm going to save this and I have downloaded a plugin. It's now on my workstation and from my workstation we're going to upload it to XI. Okay, we're back in XI. We're going to upload this plugin. We're going to browse to it, double click it, upload the plugin, and there it is, installed successfully. Now, there is a little bit more work to do, and I'm not going to cover that now, but I am going to point you to this document. This document is very specific. It's going to go through some of what we just went through here and getting you all the way to new plugin was installed successfully, which you just saw. And it's also going to go through testing your plugin from the command line. You're going to set the arguments. You're going to set critical. You're going to set warning. You're going to take care of all the finer details of getting your plugin to work exactly the way you want. I also told you that I would get you a link to a document if you wanted to write your own plugin. Here it is. The link, it's the Nagios Plugin Development Guidelines. If you're ready to take that leap, it's not all that hard. If you've got a little bit of skills, you can write it in Bash, you can write it in Python, you can write it in Perl, and you can do really anything from there. So if it's got electricity, we can write our own plugin to monitor it. Thanks so much for listening. We'll see you at the next one.